popping. No gunshots, but they getting low, low. up guys today i'm back with another video <laughs> and today we are going to encounter another text editor okay and and i'll show you the crux in the end of the video and see the whole video because you won't get the crux until you see the whole video okay every word is important here okay so please see until the end okay and give this video a like and subscribe if you really like this channel and comment down below if you have any other text editor you want me to encounter and let's just get started already I'm all charged up okay so I'll go in here and the new text editor name is Sublime Text, okay? You may be heard of it, you may be not, but let's just get on with it, okay? I'll say Sublime Text Download, as simple as it gets, okay? Let's give it, go, go, baby. Yep, there we go, force him to click. Come on, boy. Yep, so let's just get started with it, shall we? So, how to download it? This is the... Wow, okay. So, yep, so Windows 64 bit or Windows. I'll go for 64 bit. Okay. And there, I have an install. As always, I don't install it while recording. I have it pre installed. Yep. And in here, this. Okay. I'll hit enter to run it. Run, big boy, run. Yep. I'll do one thing. Apps. Sublime text. It's empty because I have uninstalled it, obviously. Okay. One, two, three, four. Yep, there we go, yes. I'll add it manually. Just install it first, okay, and then I'll show you its abilities, okay? So, there we go. We have sublime text, okay? I'll pin it. So I don't have to, you know, move it back again. I'll put it here next to just to decode. And let's just get started. Okay. So I'll open it, just click on it, and as you can see, it's so freaking fast. It's like notepad itself. Is that the notepad? Hit enter. As you can see, it's this, and it's this. It's like pretty, you know, fast. Okay? So I'll give it an experiment of opening a billion of these and I'll show it in the end so that's actually the thing with it okay now I'm opening one billion of these so let's see what happens to my computer as you can see man this is going dumb and dumb and dumb boy okay so how many did this thing open okay Oh shit, I opened Excel, I'll pass, so I think I'm recording, yep I'm recording, so I think it's a thousand or a hundred, bro this is some number, oh shit, I open Excel again, I don't care, obviously, it just won't open, okay, so as you can see, it's like a billion of these, okay, I just can't keep minimizing these. Just look at them going. Just look at them. Okay? So this is the thing, man. You can open a billion of these and it won't touch your computer. Okay? So I'll open my task manager. Yeah, it won't open, obviously. Okay? I'll right click, close 
all the windows, okay? As you can see, it's like in a snap of a finger, okay? So that's the main thing of it, okay? Wait. Okay, now this is starting. Okay, now can I start task manager? Okay, so now let's open this one trillion times and see again what the hell will happen. Okay, I'm opening one billion of these again. It's like a joke. Okay. Okay. Boom. I think it has a limit of opening. So, as you can see, you heard the sound of it. It won't open. So, I'll see my performance. Performance. My shit. It's just using 1.3, 1.83 GB RAM. Okay. That's actually pretty high because I am just using a three, I mean two GB RAM PC, and as you can see, it's hundred percent CPU. Okay, since my CPU is core to duo, <laughs> okay, you'll be surprised of that. That my CPU is Intel core to duo, and I'm just with two GB RAM. Okay, so most of the phones today in today's date have four GB RAM at the least though my computer is even down that still this managed to open that much tabs so believe how lightweight this thing is just look at it okay yep die okay so I'm not recording yeah good thing I am so the I'm making it I'm just making a tutorial for okay not you know so much deep into it actually i will go deep but not that deep okay so i'll open this like snap of finger it's open unlike visual city codes like forever to open okay okay so where was it yep so file open folder Okay, and I'll go with the teaching folder to be obvious. Teaching folder, main.py, I'll delete it. Delete. Yep, delete, yeah. And to right click on the folder and make a new file, unlike Visual Studio Code, you don't have to, you know, do this. You have to hit Control S. And there we go, you have to rename it here and control shift p and recording you know, the good thing about it okay just not open okay it's loading it it's done okay i'll go back My recording yep back i am okay so what you gotta do is install dependencies here. If you want Emmet, you say Emmet and just install it. And there we go. Yep, where was I? My recording back again. Yep. Okay, so if I want to install Emmet, it's Emmet. And <laughs> oh, I think I have already installed, so it won't let me install it back. Okay. So there are thousands of it. If it's a JavaScript, JavaScript console, JavaScript as an add a completion, it gives me add a completion. Okay. So one thing about that, so if I say script that JS in this thing, so I won't get the add a completion right in this thing. Okay. So for add a completion, do nothing. Do not install any extension. Just go to the tools and go to the project. Okay, where's the settings? Ah, sorry, go to the prefer preferences and hit settings. Okay, quick. And as you can see, don't touch any of these. Just write this line of code. Say add a complete equals true. Okay? So this is basically a setting that JSON for Visual Studio Code users. Okay? 
font size so just like settings that JSON okay so now I can get the whole thing document okay the get element by ID as you can see it's pretty good okay so though for those like me who have two GBRM PCs they can't run Visual Studio Code they just close their eyes and download this okay trust me this is the best thing you would have ever seen okay I'll rename it to main.py okay and now I'll control S to save it print my name is Dave okay and say build okay build as usual it won't build I don't know why so this is actually very very tricky for the build thing okay python and now I can say build python and I don't have whoa this is the thing okay my name is Dave okay so this is you know too good to be true for me actually because I'm using a lone PC okay and so this is a pretty cool text editor so what can I else what else um should be downloading and all those things I think that's it for this video and as always I love your beautiful face and I'll see you in the next video if you want to you know message me or something email at this one and join my discord because that's the only social media I am actually on and please please subscribe my channel boom there's the email you can send me on and and what where is it and please subscribe my channel hit the like icon and comment down below if you want me to explore any new text editor and until then bye okay i'll meet you in the next video